welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Sharon, aka the Mel Nostalgic Runner. We are back for another Get Fit With Me series, and this is going to be another video by um, Ariana um, Elizabeth. And this is another dance workout. This is Tone and Dance Workout Party Two. This is the gospel. So I am assuming this is going to be like um, it says elevation rhythmic dance workout, and it's supposed to be. Um, a gospel type deal and it's only five minutes, a little bit over five minutes. So I figured this is a good way to get things going. Well, for me, I'm winding down, but the plan is for me with the winding down is I'm going to do this last workout and then I'm going to take a shower and then switch that to Epsom salt bath for the foot because I will give you a heads up. My ankle still is not completely recovered. Um, for those who don't know, I rolled my ankle while I was on vacation and I thought it was a grade one, but it was more like a grade two. Yeah. <laughs> so your girl has been not running. I put myself right back on injury reserve a year after I took myself off the of injury reserve. A mess, a mess. Getting old is interesting. It doesn't suck. It's interesting. We'll just say that. <laughs> the, bo the body doesn't bounce back the way it used to. But anyway, <sighs> let's get into the video. Thank you. 
settled i am totally going to look up um so for those who don't know the reason why i haven't been doing as many yoga videos is there just isn't as much yoga content creators creating yoga on youtube right now they're probably either just doing it in a studio or who knows maybe they're taking a content break um i know youtube itself is not paying what it used to for those who are monetized your girl ain't there yet. Yeah, she's working on it, but I also don't really do this channel for that. This is just more of a creative outlet for me. So if I get monetized, great. If I don't, <laughs> whatever. But um, anyway, neither here nor there. Um, this just made me decide I'm also going to do more content um like dance videos as far as like dance workout videos, maybe hit workouts. Um, she also does do bar, the same content creator does bar. Um, I do want to maybe kind of dabble in that a little bit. And then I did mention before I wanted to dabble in the Pilates more. But at this point, it's time for me to mix up things as far as the workouts are concerned with this channel, along with other some of the other content I do, because things content-wise is just not what it was. You know, I started this channel last year, and last year there was still... <laughs> some remnants of 2020 still here so there was still a lot more content to kind of work off of and create and have ideas so now with there being less and less things out there your girl has to get more creative and create more content um also i do want to create more content for myself that's not necessarily tied to reviewing other people's content so i am hoping that i do get something like that going I'm just trying to think of ideas of what to do. I'm not quite there yet on what the ideas that I want to do, but I definitely want to keep it very much melanin focused, but then also focus on the other aspects of like what I got going on. For those who know, y'all know I love my health and beauty. You also know, I mean, you probably can't tell right now because child, I, <laughs> I, I'm winding down and this is also workout day. And um, anyway, so I want to focus more on that. I also want to focus on some of the things I do in the city. Because, I mean, I am starting to go back to being outside and out and about in the city a lot more. Um, which, <laughs> it took me forever to get to that point. Uh, I, call, I kind of also want to share. I did do, um, I did go to the museum, the Art Institute recently. And I kind of want to share my experience with that. I'm not going to share who I was with and all that. But I do want to share that experience as far as, like, the things are really, really cool and awesome in the city, the different breweries. I think I'm going to start trying to like just mix up the content and just show you a day in the life, if you will. Um, and not necessarily call it ready to go outside. I'm not sure what I'm going to call it. It might be just a vlog of just things I do. Um, even with the Puerto Rico trip, I'll be fully transparent. I did not vlog it the way I wanted to, but also because now y'all know, I was kind of not feeling that great physically. <laughs> my allergies were destroying me that whole entire trip. And then I would say like the fifth or sixth day of me being there, I twisted my ankle. So it was kind of a wrap for me after that. <laughs> um, but I am going to maybe try to get some more travel content. I think I am going to try to go and see my sister 
um, this year. I do want to go to the New England area this year again. Um, I'm debating on whether I'm going to go to Cape Cod again because I ain't seeing my Chicago family in a minute. Or if I want to completely switch it up and do another solo trip and just go to Maine because I really miss Maine. <laughs> like, I really miss Maine. Um, I kind of almost just want to do a weekend trip there. I don't need to be there the whole entire time. I, I mean, I think four days would be enough going to Maine. Um, but... The thing is, if I do that, I would just either need to just do Portland or do like Bar Harbor. I wouldn't be able to do both, um, <laughs> which is kind of why I'm like, man, four days wouldn't be enough to do that because I really want to do Portland, Maine because the food is awesome for those who have never been. It's chef's kiss. Um, and I'm a foodie. For those who don't know, I am such a foodie. Or Arcadia because Arcadia is in Bar Harbor and that. For those who've never been, that's an experience, and that's like one of the most underrated national parks in the country. I feel like most people don't even know about it. It's awesome. So I'm thinking about maybe trying to do that too in the fall, um, just to mix it up and do something different. And now, but I also am trying to be conservative about my spending. So you see how conflicted I am. Your girls is trying to figure things out. Um, it's just now I have this thing with my new job. For those who don't realize I started a new job. And so far, the work-life balance is a thousand times it's better. I <laughs> The way, even though I physically look like a mess with this um, allergy, like the allergy shiners, I am the most relaxed I've ever been, even working, and the most at peace I've been in a minute. I didn't realize how much stress, I did not realize how stressed out I was until... You know, I was forced to not be with my job anymore that I was in before. And also, too, you notice, and this looks modest. It's not great, but, like, for those who know, I have nails. I haven't had nails in, like, three years. I was stressed out so much, I was always biting my nails. I know that's a disgusting habit. I hate it for me. But when I'm really, 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 really stressed out, that's what happens. And also gain weight. And literally all the things that caused that is stress related was happening. And I was like, okay, we're finally turning things around. The way I don't know how to jump off of a train, don't know how to leave a train wreck. It's, it's, it's wild. I, the, I could see the train about to be wrecking and I'm staying on the train. Your girl is really ridiculous at times. But anyway, that's not why you're here. Um... I just went on a little bit of a rant, so you got a little bit of extra there. But anyway, I am gonna put <laughs> I am gonna put her content at the end of this video so you can check out the video. It is very inspirational, it's gospel based, so there's that. Um, but you don't have to be someone who believes in religion or God to enjoy it. It was just inspiring. It's definitely take it as inspiration. Um and also too. I modified it like I did before because ankle. Anyway, please like, comment, subscribe to the channel to get anything out of the content. It's your girl Sharon, aka the Melon Nostalgic Runner, and I will see you next time. Bye.